This is the story of Ducky Momo, a miniature pincher by breed. Shelly Bazuski was the little dog's owner. She volunteered for a rescue agency. Now, Shelly Bazuski met Libby Osterbauer, and she seemed nice enough at the time. But Libby was a stalker, a psychopath, and a menace to canines. Ducky Momo, where are you? We've been waiting on the porch. Ducky Momo, where are you? We'll be waiting forevermore, 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 forevermore. Osterbauer professed her love. She told Shelly time and again. Shelly said, I'll never feel that same way. And that was the end. Fueled by unrequited love, in darkness Libby stole away. And she brought that little dog Ducky into a world of pain. Ducky Momo. Where are you? We've been waiting on the porch. Ducky Momo, where are you? We'll be waiting forevermore, 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 forevermore. Shelly hung signs all over the town from Southdale to East Lake. There wasn't a telephone pole in sight without a picture of Ducky Momo's face. Missing $500 reward, she posted last July. If she coulda, she probably woulda, ridden it across the sky, saying, Ducky Momo, where are you? We've been waiting on the porch. Ducky Momo, where are you? We'll be waiting forevermore, 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 forevermore. Elizabeth R. Osterbauer, of 24 years young, was accused of B&E and kidnapping Shelly's dog. Osterbauer brought Ducky Momo out to the park one day, left him in that marsh to drown, that's what the plaintiff claimed. This is the story that has no moral, just a senseless act of violence. You never can tell what a person will do if left to their own devices. Shelly Bazuski probably knows that she'll never see Ducky again. But late last night I saw her in the snow posting signs up just the same. Crying Ducky Momo, where are you? You've been waiting on the porch. Ducky Momo, where are you? We'll be waiting forevermore. Ducky Momo, where are you? We've been waiting on the porch. Ducky Momo.